2018 Mitsubishi Outlander FEV first drive, nailing the sweet spot. For years now, while the Mitsubishi brand has languished here in the US, other parts of the world have been enjoying the Outlander FEV. It's Europe's best-selling plug-in hybrid, and Mitsubishi has been improving on it over the years, testing it, refining the technology and punishing the vehicle in competitions like the Baja Portugal 500 and the Asia Cross Country Rally. Now, as electric vehicles begin to gain greater acceptance, and as Mitsu turns its brand around, it will finally offer the Outlander FEV in America at the end of this year. As Mitsubishi prepares to launch the Outlander FEV stateside, we had the rare opportunity to drive it across the interior of Santa Catalina Island, off the coast of Los Angeles, to test it out on some rugged, scenic roads. Sitting inside the Outlander FEV, we were actually pleased with the interior. It was simple and clean, and the plastics didn't feel especially cheap. Sure, it wasn't the thoughtful design or plush touch points of the other available plug-in crossovers on the market, but the Outlander FEV also doesn't share the same price tag. We definitely found it to be more attractive and appealing than the inside of, say, a Chevrolet Equinox. If you were expecting a pile of hot garbage from Mitsubishi, you were way off. When we popped open the rear lift gate to take a look, we found our near ideal tailgating vehicle. In the rear cargo area was a ton of space, a large speaker, cup holders and a standard three-prong outlet, perfect for plugging in a slow cooker, blender, or any other appliance you could find useful at a football game or campsite. Later, when we would take a break from our drive at Catalina Island's Shark Harbor, we'd be treated to a smoothie prepared and a blender plugged into the AC outlet. If you happen to use all 12 kilowatt hours of energy, the gas engine will fire up to serve as a generator. The Toyota 4Runner may have had the party mode button, but the Outlander FEV would be our pick for the stadium parking lot, 